Well, for starters, do you want to eat the same thing every day for every meal for the rest of your life? Variety is the spice of life. But if you're talking economically and about other human beings, well, for one, considering we have merit-based immigration, they bring skilled labor that is lacking into our economy, let alone a lot of, say, Now, I don't know about you, but personally, I love pizza. Indian food, Chinese food, Mexican food. Who doesn't love tacos? Now, yes, while they are extremely culturally appropriated, and we made our own versions of these ethnic foods, that's not even to mention that such as the agriculture industry and other things, a lot of times, foreign immigrants are willing to do the jobs that we as Canadians are not. They are hard workers, they contribute to our economy, and never take advantage of our social systems because they cannot. Now, some of these things differ from Canada to America, depends where you are. But immigration not only keeps our economy, especially in Canada, going, because the vast majority of Canadian residents are not having kids. Someone's got to pay for our retirement pitily as though it may be. Diversity also brings with it a wealth of new ideas, new innovations and technologies, and a perspective that is not your own. A chance to learn, grow, and become a better human being. One that can see not only do we live in a global economy, but the world is full of vastly different people, cultures, and experiences. And that's a good thing. Now, I don't know your stance specifically, but we all fucking know. The Conservative Party only gives a crap when it's the brown immigrants. More than welcome to receive Ukrainian refugees. But just look how they kicked and screamed with Syrian refugees. Diversity is our strength, because only a weakling wants to stay in their own bubble. We're all of one race, the human race, and all that. Don't take my word for it. You can go look up the statistics. Look up the studies that have been done on multiculturalism. Or don't. Honestly, I don't have that much faith. Make an asinine comment and I'll block you. Whatever. Also, just so we're perfectly clear, pineapple belongs on pizza.